Now from the night team, he was on the run from police for days. Now he'll be behind bars for years. A judge has sentenced Christopher Mendoza to 16 years in prison for a crime spree that included pulling a gun at a Walmart, carjacking a man, and then firing a gun at police. Team 12's Mitch Carr breaks it all down for you. Keep your hands out of your pocket. This all started shortly before Christmas in 2019. Police arrived at a Walmart near I-10 and Estrella Parkway, responding to reports of 34-year-old Christopher Mendoza threatening his girlfriend with a gun. Gun, 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 gun! According to police, Mendoza got away in the chaos after the store was evacuated. They say he carjacked a man in the Walmart parking lot, driving toward Avondale and running into a house. That led to a standoff with police. He got away that night, but later came back to the same house, resulting in another standoff. I know you're inside. Come out to the front door with your hands up. Police tear gassed the house. But Mendoza escaped again. Finally, Buckeye police say he stole a pest control truck on Barado Way. He encountered police again. He was waving a gun. He was pointing a gun to his head. Waving a gun, saying he had a hostage and threatening to kill himself. Sometimes people become more dangerous to our community as, as, they, uh, as they continue to run. They shot and wounded him, ending a three-day fugitive run. For those three days and the crimes he pleaded guilty to committing, the judge sentenced Mendoza to 16 years behind bars for aggravated assault with a deadly weapon and kidnapping. In a statement, County Attorney Rachel Mitchell wrote, A violent offender was held accountable for his actions. Our streets are safer because of the brave actions of law enforcement and diligent work of prosecutors. Mitch Carr, 12 News.